Tonight, it's game two of a four-game series between the Kansas City Royals and the Chicago White Sox. Royals with that one 4 3 rotation ERA, second best in baseball. His bound opponent is Brady Singer. This is a guy with terrific stuff. However, the Sox have handled him very well over the course of his career. His last two outings last year really spiked those numbers back-to-back -back six run starts against the White Sox. And we'll see if uh, the Sox can handle him as they've handled him in the past. Brady Singer making start number two this year, and it is Ben Intendi. Vinny connects with Singer for the first out of the game. Mankata with a good eye at the plate draws himself a one-out walk. So the White Sox have a runner with one out. Now Luis Robert Jr. So the 3-1 is chopped over the pitcher's head near second base. Step on second, throw back to first, double play. Frazier, second baseman, right at the bag. So Brady Singer got exactly what he needed. Look at Eric Fetty, who goes to the mound for his second start. As a member of the White Sox, last time out, he made it into the fifth inning. Garcia. Now the pitch, swing and a miss. He struck him out. Got him on a fastball. Bobby Witt, two out of three with a walk. Run scored and a double last night. Chopper down third. Mancata charging will make the play two down. Now Vinny Pasquantino. Base at center field for Vinny, who hasn't been getting many fastballs lately, but he was ready for that first pitch fastball. As Salvador Perez stands in. Ooh. Well hit center field. Robert is at the wall and it hits the top of the wall and somehow stayed in the ballpark. But the Royals will take a 1 0 lead. He tried to put a little wrinkle on a pitch to Salvi, and man, did he torch it. Man, I don't know how it stayed in the ballpark. We'll have to show it. This will be a better look here. Oh, boy, yeah. And look, there's a nice little wind. Well, Gavin Sheets has been one of the hottest hitters on the team. Take a look at what he's done in the last two games. Gavin Isn't Sheets, good. send it back to right, and it is long gone. Talk about being locked in. Gavin Sheets. His first home run of the season, and we are all tied at one apiece here in the second. Gavin's had the opportunity. With Eloy going down, Gavin's starting to get at bats. So a 1-1 tie in the second inning, and now Andrew Vaughn, the batter, popped up in short right field. In comes Renfro to make the play. Overall numbers are average against Chicago. Back to the middle, and Junior is right there behind second base, and Grossman, who was called up from the minor leagues before the game tonight is out 6 3 2 down and a swing and a miss so Singer gets a strikeout would be his first gives up the home run to Sheets we go to the bottom of the second Velasquez homered in the fourth inning last night got him looking third strikeout of the game for Eric Fetty two of them have been looking and he didn't like to call a Bill Miller but Miller said it had the inside part of the plate it's borderline single for Adam Frazier now Hunter Renfro here's the payoff to Renfro fourth strikeout of the game for Eric Fetty Bill Miller tonight has a fairly generous strike zone and that's something that hitters have to be aware of Isbell takes high and draws a walk Garcia hits first pitch on the ground to Moncada. He'll throw to Lopez at second to end the threat. After two, Sox one, Royals one. That ends the inning. A very quick one, two, three inning for Brady Singer. No runs, no hits, no errors. Nobody left for the White Sox. Bottom of the third is next. Royals and White Sox tied at one. Here's Pasquantino. The barrel is pointing straight up. There's a flare out into right center and a sliding catch. By Grossman. That'll play. Yeah, really nice read and distance covered by Robbie Grossman in right. Pasquantino thought he had his second hit of the night. And Robbie Grossman, since donning that White Sox uniform, which has been about an hour or so, maybe an hour and a half. It's a single for Salvador Perez. So he's at first with two outs, and now MJ Melendez bats. Here he is with two outs. Melendez fly ball left field. About five steps. Makes a head high catch. Inning over. Game tied at one, top of the fourth inning. Brady Singer faces Johan Moncada, switch hitter batting left. Moncada grounds it softly, straight away second base. Adam Frazier scoops it up midway between first and second, throws to first, and Moncada's out one away. 0 1 pitch is stroke back up the middle. Frazier backhand stop up the middle, throw to first in time. He got him. A nice play and a hot shot by Adam Frazier, and there are two outs. Sheets bounces it left side. Garcia to his left in the shift. Scoops it up. Spins. Throws to first on target. In time. Inning over. Another 1-2-3 inning for Brady Singer. His defense on the infield helps him out. What's Andrew Vaughn? He has set down nine in a row since 
Gavin Sheets tied the game with a home run in the second inning. Over the four seamers, he's using more of them tonight. It's a swing and a chopper to the right side. Second baseman Frazier is on it. He'll flip to first for the out. Make it ten in a row set down by Brady Singer after that home run by Sheets. He's really locked in. And Brady strikes him out. And Brady has three. Yeah, now Brady, he, he piled up 10 strikeouts in his last outing. The fact that he's getting early count ground balls, that's really good. Swing and a miss and a strikeout and a fastball. Four strikeouts and 12 in a row set down by Brady Singer. Well, you can tell when Brady Singer's on his game. The sinker slider combo is all about ground balls. I got just two flyouts between his game in Minnesota and tonight versus the White Sox. Pretty good keeping that ball out of the air. At the top of the sixth at Kauffman Stadium, Royals and White Sox remain tied at one. The singer has retired 12 consecutive batters. Lopez rolls it toward first. Pasquantino lunges to his right, gloves it, throws to Singer, covering in time to get Lopez. One away. Slider lifted down the left field line. Melendez sprints over and he runs it down. He makes a chest high grab running toward the foul line. Two outs now. Benintendi grounds it to the left side. Witt to his right. Backhand stop. Plant throw to first. A rocket in time to get Benintendi. Side retired. Another blink and you might have missed it. One, two, three inning for Brady Singer. Salvi, MJ, and Velasquez. And that one's blooped to right. Salvi is three for three. The second walk of the night for Eric Fetty. But that puts runners on first and second with nobody out. It brings Pedro Grafal out of the third base dugout. He's prepared to make a pitching change. Both runners advance and brings up Adam Frazier. Slow roller back to Brebbia. He comes home and he got him. Nice awareness by John Brebbia to cut off the run at home. We stay tied at one. But we told you about the fact that Selby has no speed. That was an awkward throw for John Brebbia. Fielded the little bouncer off the mound right side and then had to readjust his body to throw home accurately. And now Grafol is coming out of the third base dugout. And so Brebby is getting some attention from the training staff. Probably hurt himself on that awkward throw. He kind of had to contort his yeah. upper body. It was actually when he was coming off the mound. Mm -hmm. He hobbled a little bit coming off the mound. He's going to try to throw a couple of warm up pitches and see if everything is OK. Now Brebby has to leave. We'll see about Salvi if he comes out. Salvi, remember, got a little strawberry on his leg. and. Baltimore and things like that won't heal high target the pitch coming swing and a miss on a high fastball Wilson strikes out Renfro to end the threat the Royal strand two off to the seventh Brady singers back on the mound facing Johan Moncada there's a base hit into right center for Moncada that is just their second true base runner sheets hit a home run in the second inning but as far as dealing with runners it's been Moncada twice with a walk in the first and now single in the seventh. First pitch to Robert. Hit on the ground towards shortstop. Wade's got it. Slings to second. There's one. Relay to first. A little high safe. That might be it for Brady Singer with the lefty Gavin Sheets coming to the plate. The Singer's only thrown 72 pitches and only retired 15 straight entering this inning. But that is indeed the end of the line for Brady Singer tonight after six and a third pretty darn good innings so he walks off the mound to an ovation John Schreiber comes in the bottom of the eighth inning now with the runner in scoring position to breaking the one one tie it's up to MJ the pitch line left field sinking and it's a hit around third comes Blanco throw home is cut off throw to second is not in time one of his nicest swings we've seen of the year ninth inning two to one Royals and it's up to Will Smith close things out Moncada down he goes here comes Robert Luis Robert Jr. lines this one to left and it gets down it'll go all the way to the wall oh, no no Robert comes up gimpy and that is not what we want to see. No, it looks to me like it's probably a hamstring, could be a calf. Now here's the superstar, Luis Robert Jr., being walked off the field. It's James MacArthur. He's in a big spot here. Right-hander deals and a slow roller to short. Went to second for one, back to first. It is a double play. And with that one pitch, the Royals get two outs and a victory.